Hey, what's good, YouTube? Name of Mass Collector, back with another video. Uh, today is, is a mail week, a couple, couple weeks here of mail that I've got. Um, <clears throat> I'm mainly just going after numbered cards now, um, unless it's a part of a rainbow, you know, that I'm trying to get. Um, mainly just because I think the print runs are getting really high and a lot of stuff. And it just seems like, you know, the best way to know what the print run is, is to get cards that are uh, serial numbered. So, what is this? Yep. Okay, so like I was saying, uh, just kind of going after the ones that are serial numbered or some weird stuff um, or cards that I just like. So um, not really following the hype. Like I have zero Herbert cards. I have zero Joe Burrow cards, shit like that. So I kind of betting on my gut, which is uh, Christian Woods still. I just think he... Next year, man, man, we makes the all-star team, um, which I think he will, his cards are gonna skyrocket. And the ones that are gonna go up the most, I think, um, besides his rated rookie cards, which is his official, you know, professional um, rookie card, you know, not the contenders, UNLV stuff, shit like that, but um, the rated rookie cards, um, but after that, there's nothing until 2019. So there's a four year gap between cards there. So, you know, when you look at, um, especially like uh, the, the Hoops premium stock was kind of like his first card that came out um, besides, uh, you know, Donruss and things like that. And then this year as well, you know, of course, but, um, but anyways, let's get going here. Um, <clears throat> here's a couple couple cards I got from uh, uh, from eBay. It's prints. Um, it's from a pro set set superstars music cards. And Prince is one of my favorite artists of all time. Um, and these are actually pretty good condition. So. Pick these up. Love me some prints. You know, arguably the most talented artist to ever live. Because he could play anything. Best guitar player ever. And we can argue about that in the comments if you want. Debate that, but um, it's true. Um, so this is a Kirill Kaprizov Dazzlers. Uh, it's his rookie card as well, upper deck. It's an insert. Pick that up. Um, I got two of these uh, Kevin Herter white sparkles. I got both of them for like 50 bucks. And um, he had a pretty good run here in the playoffs kind of fizzled out there where I think he might have been trying too hard at the end there but I think he played pretty damn well overall and um, you know these sparkle cards are hard to get um, and this you're pretty good in condition this one for sure looks really good so I picked them up what the heck you never know um, I got this Jordan Bowman's best. It's not the refractor, it's just a regular one, but it's in really good condition. It's a little off-centered, but overall um, it looks great. And I, I don't have this regular one, so I, I picked it up. Um, here's my... Make sure I pull this pile away here. Um, Patrick Ewing, Carl Malone, Bowman's best refractor. And again, you guys know I love these cards. Just keep picking them up if I find some good deals. Um, Sean Kemp, 
with Glenn Rice. These are really low pop cards um, for graded ones. So, um, Dennis Rodman, this is a pink ice, so it's not numbered. Prism. Uh, blue fast break out of 175. Red Rodman fast break out of 125. Another blue fast break out of 175. Oh, sure, look at that. Another red one out of 125. Uh, purple out of 99. Blue shimmer. This one looks really good. Perfectly centered. Um, I love these shimmer cards. Uh, this is out of 35. And I picked up one of his white sparkles, which this one looks really nice, um, centering wise. So definitely gonna get this one graded. Doesn't look that very well centered on the back, but on the front side, it looks pretty good. So I don't, but yeah, these sparkle, white sparkle cards, I really like these for, really catch the eye. Um, here's an optic, Hall Kings. Lime green. Uh, this is numbered out of 149, 2017. Optic. It's really cool. Uh, Rodman camo from uh, Excalibur Crusade. Uh, this one is not numbered. Oh, it looks pretty rad. And then I got this one here. It's like the 1961 throwback edition. I think this is what the cards looked like in 61. Yeah, vintage. So, it looked really nice center wise. So, I picked it up. And then we also have this red, white, and blue prism. Not numbered. Um, I picked up this one. I've never seen these before. So this is a Topps Classic. And it looks like some sort of a redemption because um, it's got a Topps seal on it. This came out in 2005. But I just love the design on this thing. You know, it's a refractor. Looks really good. Um, the only gripe I have is he's in the Pistons uniform and not the Bulls uniform, but otherwise I think it looks really cool. I like it a lot. And then I picked up one of these too, this uh, Leaf, these that just came out here just recently, um, pro set style and auto. So it's a sticker auto, but again, the, the autograph is like right in the uh, sticker. Nothing's running off. It looks pretty good. So I picked up that. And what I do like about this too is that, you know, with Leaf, they can't have the uh, uh, Chicago Bulls label or logo or anything like that visible. So, you know, the picture from the back, you can see his name and his number. But, you know, you don't really notice that the Chicago Bull logo is not on his shorts or on the front. Um, so I think it looks really cool. Like, it looks like a legit card. So that's why I like this. Uh, next, we'll get into uh, some Seawood. Um, so I got a conference finals ticket. This is out of 75. Uh, this here is a... Court Kings, Artist Proof. Um, it's not numbered, but it is the Artist Proof, which you can see right here. Listed. Uh, next one here is a Donruss Elite. Number out of 99. I 
with uh, the blue H-Town jerseys. Those are cool. Um, red Ice, I have uh, three of these. You can get these cheap. Um, my advice is if you guys are looking at um, picking up, you know, your favorite players with these red ice or orange ice or whatever the Target exclusive is or the Walmart exclusive, there's going to be hundreds, thousands of these things available. So make sure that you're looking for the nice, well-centered ones because they're going to be out there. More people are ripping it. More breaks are happening. There's going to be a lot of that stuff happening. So, um, Ruby Wave, I picked this up. It was cheap and, you know, it looked really, really nice centered on the front. So I picked it up. Uh, here's the uh, Blue Wave T-Mall. Really good condition. I really like the looks of this one. Uh, and this is just a blue prism, uh, 199. Uh, fast break red, uh, 125. You got a blue cracked ice. This is out of 125. Orange wave out of uh, 60. Here's an orange prism out of 49. Got another blue shimmer. I think this is my third or fourth one now. Uh, this is out of 35. Love the look of this card. I have a really nice uh, HGA slab one, 9.5. This looks sick. Mojo out of 25. Looks great. Uh, green Pulsar out of 25. And actually, I think this, uh, yeah, see that print line going through it? I kind of, I didn't see that in the picture, but it's there. Um, I wasn't going to complain about it. I got a pretty good deal on it, so. This one's out of 25. Looks great. Uh, this is an Artist Proof out of 25 NBA Hoops. Hollow. Uh, this one here is number out of 15. This is the 11 out of 15. It's like a red and blue blast. Oops. Um, this is out of 99. Red Mega Box. Uh, I'm not sure what they're called. I think it's just a Mega Box exclusive. Kind of has that mojo look to it, but I know that's not what it is. Um, this is a black and gold. This is numbered out of eight. And uh, love the look of this thing. I, got, I just got lucky, I found it listed. 30 bucks. And then I have this one here, uh, black Flash NBA Hoops Premium, one on one, and it looks it looks really good, really good condition. So I'm starting to get closer. I got I need seven more to make this whole rainbow complete. I got two one on ones now. Christian Wood here. So I got another one of those Elite. This is just the base, I believe. It's not numbered, but it's a hollow version. Um, cracked Ice Hoops Premium, got a couple of those, along with a green prism. Uh, season ticket, this is out of 25 contend contenders. Uh, this is a 99 semifinal ticket contenders. And then I got a bunch of these Noir cards. Um, not really sure why I keep buying them. The low numbered ones I am anyways, but I know that these things don't grade for shit because they're so thick and they, they're easily damaged. Well, this is a out of, out of 10. This one here is out of five. Um, out of 99. 
This one here is one out of five. I saw one on one was on sale um, for like 470 bucks or something, and I just couldn't pull the trigger on it. Um, football, I got a Devin Funches one on one here though. Gold vinyl, tops chrome. Seems to be having a pretty good camp at Green Bay. And then I also picked up this uh, rookie playbook. Um, this is a, it's a numbered out of 99, but it looks sick. So it's got it's two, it's a dual patch. It's got like a shadow box type of thing in there. I think I got this for like 20 bucks, so I thought it was really neat looking. Be cool to get this slabbed up somehow. I think some some, some companies do it. I'm gonna have to look and see which ones do. That one. And then for graded cards, I got a uh, John Collins Silver Prism 9. And I've been picking up some of his stuff lately just because I think he's gonna be signing some mega deal with somebody at some point. Um, I picked up this Rodman Hot Numbers 9. Got a really good deal on that. I just love these cards. They look amazing in a slab. The, uh, I mean, it just, the hologram just, it just jumps right at you. Um, I got two more Christian Wood nines. I think one was like 70 bucks and the other one was 60. So I got a really good deal on those on an auction. And then I got another 10 that I bought. So i um, been picking these up whenever I can just because I really do think that he's going to have a really good year next year. And um, I'm going to reap the benefits of that, I think. So. Really appreciate you guys checking out the video. Um, also, if you have not, please subscribe. Um, I do a lot of these mail videos and submission videos, things like that. Check out my playlist on my channel and uh, you'll see everything that I'm into. Um, also like that, hit that like button to give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment, let me know what you guys think. Um, and uh, hit that bell for notifications when I drop new videos and we'll see you in the next one. Later guys.